Representative from Graham. Say what's up, America? I think you should know me, right? Hug a half a replica. It's 7:28 a.m. and I'm making a video that's funny. But in my last video, I have shown you my uh, Jarvis-like AI that I call Dennis. So in this video, I'm gonna show you what are the things we need to make that Jarvis-like AI Dennis. Okay? So first of all, by the things I mean modules, modules and or the libraries of Python. So we will need first of all. I'm opening my Google Chrome. Now till that time, you see this code. Okay. Now here are the modules that we will need to have. Okay. So I'm gonna tell you where to find these modules. Okay. Now, first of all, we need speech recognition module. Okay, so I will just write here speech. Okay. Well, my system is working a little bit slow. Okay, so this is it. Now here you can go on this link. This here, speech recognition 3.6.0 Python package index. Okay. So here you can see that this is the download option and uh, it works actually it is 3.6.0 version okay and now it works with python 2.7, python 3.3, python 3.4, python 3.5, python 3.6 that means this module works with this series and I would recommend you all to get the python 2.7.13 because that comes with an upgraded PIP that will uh, help you to install the Python, Python packages and uh, if you don't know how to install the Python packages you can see my another video and uh, since this is a dot G's that is dot G's that uh, type file you can uh, install this file via PIP so just click on it this link and then you can install it after it downloads now the thing is that suppose uh, if you are not working on a x86 based computer or an x86-64 based computer then you will have to install pi audio this module here this module you will have to install this module in order to get good results and in order to work your program because uh, there are some files which x64 based computers do not have but in x86 and x86-64 based computers have now how do you find how will you find that uh, your computer is x64 or x86 based so to do that um, wait a second guys You just have to go on here. Okay. My system is a little bit slow. Okay. Here, you just have to this PC or the computer in Windows 7 or my computer in Windows XP. Well, I'm using Windows 10 computer, so I will go on this. Okay, 
you have to go on the property sorry so here i'm gonna click on properties so here we have got this now here you can see that whether your computer is x is six or x is equal to here this line this line tells what is your computer size so here my computer is x64 based processor that's why i'm using pi audio otherwise you don't need to install pi audio in your project okay so i'll just set it now okay now the second thing we will need is pi audio because I'm on x64 based computer so I'll tell you that you have that you should install pi audio okay pi audio python and remember that you will have to download 0.2.9 version of pi audio or greater than this otherwise if you will download like 0.2.8 it won't work it will show an error so just to click on it and, uh, and here you can find this just go on this link and you will get it and you also have to install this using pip remember guys i am not telling you about dot msi or dot exe file type modules this is all dot v or dot g file so here you can download them win for win32 for amd64 for win34 32 sorry so from here you can download them and install them now we will have to uh, get another module that is PYTTFX that is Python text to speech module okay this module this one well this is the module which will help you to make the mouth of your computer by this module we will uh, we will let the computer talk to us so I'm right I will write I have put it on charger now. Sorry, guys. So from here you can download it. Python package index. from here you can download it pyttx hyphen 1.1 dot tar dot gf gz sorry so you have to install it using pip now one more thing that uh, you will have to do is you have to install pywin32 but remember that don't download it because i have downloaded it and it didn't work because uh, win32 api was my computer couldn't uh, find and your computer may also not find so i'm showing you another way to download it first of all go to your uh, python folder where you have installed it may be in c drive or wherever you have installed the python so remember guys use python 2.7.13 because that will give you an upgraded pip so 
what you what you will have to do is just go on scripts okay here i have already installed python 32 and other things that's why you are seeing this thing so just press shift then uh, left key go sorry right key and the, here you will get an option open command window here then click on it and here you got it now you just have to write here pip install install sorry py pi win32 ok and now you will just have to press enter so after pressing enter uh, you will see something like this well actually it will take some time to download and install the python package that is win32 so i will just close it because i have already installed all the modules but listen guys it will take some time to install the python32 because it's a big module and you are downloading it directly from pip so it will take some time so i'll just close it here now so we will we will cover we have covered sorry yes we have covered py audio pyttx uh, speech recognition and uh, win32 well actually there is one more uh, module yes pygame you will have to download it so you will just write here pygame pygame.org oh oh okay so it is at a little bit change i don't know how well so i will just write another thing here right here unofficial website or libraries for python modules that's that you should write website now so here you can see unofficial windows binaries for python extension well actually it works for windows only because it has only windows binaries well mac and uh, other users can download it from any other website there are lots of websites websites so here it is i'll find here um So here I will click here on it. Now here you can see these are versions and uh, specified for which kind of computer we have to download it and this is the version of Python also. So you can download it from here since it is a dot wheel file you, so you will have to install it using PIP. So PIP you will have to use here now. I will just uh, okay. So we have a com completed Py Audio, PyTTX, Py Games, Speech Recognition. These are the modules that you will have to download, and other modules like Sys, OS, Web Browser, Random. You will get these pre-installed in the Python only. Okay, guys, and Win32. You will have to download Win32 also. So this is the model that you will need, and now. Now, yeah, wait a second, guys. Okay, so you will have to download a dot jpg or dot png or dot and any graphics file. Uh, actually, you will have to download a picture that you want to use in your window. Okay. In your uh, program so I I'm using this window uh, this thing 
add and manage jarvis wallpapers view then i'm using this file you can uh, use any other file so now till now we have uh, okay till now we have completed we have uh, covered all the modules and the resources that you will need to have and uh, that's it for this video because this is i'm making this video just to to tell you what we will need to make this program to make this ai okay that is artificial intelligence so this that's it for this video and uh, if you have any questions about the modules or the picture or uh, about installing pyvin 32 because that's a tedious task and uh, if you have any suggestions for me to make my videos more good for you all then you can give them in the comment box below and i will definitely read them and uh, you can also view my watch my another playlist where i have uh, given how to make games and uh, the python basics and other things and uh, till then goodbye and don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell button <laughs> beside the subscribe to get the notification of my next videos okay because this playlist is going to be very interesting and fun so goodbye